Welcome to our Tech Explainer video. Today, we're diving into the fascinating world of Python type hinting, specifically in the context of the Curses library. Our viewer is grappling with a question that many developers encounter. How do you accurately annotate the type of the standard screen object in a Curses application? Let's break down the issue. Our viewer has a simple example using the Curses library where they need to determine the type of the stitchcr parameter in their main function. The output reveals that stitchcr is of type curses.curses window, but this doesn't seem to fit well with type hinting conventions. So how can we provide an accurate type annotation for this parameter? Welcome back to another tech video. Today we're gonna to be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution for you. Guys, remember to stay a little bit crazy like me and find that resolution. Now, let's continue on. Let's start by understanding the type of the steadyCR parameter in our main function. In the curses library, steadyCR is an instance of a window object. To accurately annotate the type of status CR, we can use the window type from the curses module. However, this type is not directly accessible in the standard library. To implement this, we can define our main function with the correct type hint. Here's how you can do it. Now, when you run your program, the type hint will provide better clarity and support for type checkers, enhancing your code's reliability. In summary, use the window type from the curses module for type hinting sestessar. This will ensure your function is well annotated and clear. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. Currently, the Curses module in Python lacks complete type hinting support. While there has been some preliminary work, the Windows object is still missing. The existing stubs for Curses type the wrapper function as any meaning you can't assign a specific type to your main function's parameter right now. If you're interested, you could contribute by adding stubs to the curses module. The window object isn't too complex and could be straightforward to type. The main challenge might be figuring out where to import the window object from, possibly considering placing it in the typing module. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. The issue you're facing is that the expected type doesn't match the actual type of the object. To clarify, the type function will always give you the correct type, so it's likely that the documentation is incorrect. And guys, that's it. I hope this video has helped you and get you through to that resolution you needed. If it did, please, I'd appreciate it if you hit subscribe. Now, until the next time that you need technical help, I hope you have a good one. Cheers. Cheers.